Welcome back, fellow traders. This is Fausto from CyberTrade University. Just want to kind of go over, teach you a little beginner course regarding about uh, following big block orders. And we are looking at a stock symbol called Zoom. Probably heard about it. It's been a really popular stock after the coronavirus. Uh, a lot of people are doing webinar technology, and Zoom has been doing actually quite well due to the catastrophe of uh, because more people are doing online education. So to talk about the stock is not really the interest of as a trader of buying it or selling it, but it's more or less like, well, how do we day trade it? Or how do we see these orders? Where are these guys getting in and why the, these stocks are hitting support levels and resistance levels? And I wanna kind of just point out, looking at the stock Zoom right here, and you'll notice that Zoom obviously had a, we're looking at a intraday chart here. And the stock is obviously up pretty nicely. It's up $10 today, up 9%. But the question is, stock started this morning and had a really nice run up, but it kind of had a little bit of a problem here getting past 25. And, you know, give or take from 24 to 25, since 10.30 this morning, granted it is, what, almost 2 o'clock right now in the afternoon. Why is it having such a tough time getting past this $25 resistance levels? Because remember, the way stocks go up and go down is supply and demand, okay? Demand is made up of buyers, supply is made up of sellers. So the problem with a chart is a chart doesn't tell you who's buying it, who's selling it, who's out there getting in, getting out of it. So you need something that is called level three. Level three um, can be found on uh, so many different brokerage firms. Um, you have to ask them if they carry it, but I'm just gonna show you one of the level three tools that we use and it's called the NASDAQ book viewer. And you can get this right off the NASDAQ website. You could actually even watch a couple of videos. Um, I've done demonstrations at the NASDAQ Center as being a guest there talking about it, um, which I have a couple of more advanced videos regarding about how to utilize it. But my goal is I just want to kind of just show you, you know, the power of using level three. Now, remember, the stock is going higher. It's having a tough time breaking a resistance levels at 125. Why is it having a tough time breaking this resistance? Well, there obviously must be somebody preventing it from going higher. You can't see that on a chart. You can't see that in level two. Level two has been outdated since the 90s. You can't even tell in the long-term chart, but where you can tell is right here in the book viewer. Now, we're looking at the sell side, and you'll notice right here, the person that wants to sell um, ZM for the cheapest amount of money is at $124.15. And obviously, you could see it changing, okay? Because um, this is real time. This is live. But the thing is, I want to know why it's not going past here. Well, obviously, looking at a seller for one share at $123.91 doesn't help me. I need to look somewhere around 25 So I got to work my way down. And as I work my way down, you'll notice right around here, around 125 coincidental, there is a 5,600 share seller. And it's made up of 72 different people out there. That's a lot of different orders that make up that big block order. And let me tell you, that's a lot of money. Was that over five, six million dollars worth of stock? And it's not one person, it's 71 different people or different orders. Okay. So when you're sitting here and you're trying to analyze, you're looking at the stock, and you're like, okay, you know, what do the, all these ones mean? All these twos mean, these thousands. I mean, because some people, um, you look at these numbers like, I don't know, it moves so fast, I can't comprehend. You don't have to look at all the numbers. All you have to look at is the big block orders, what we call here at Cybertrain University, iceberg orders. And by the way, if you watch one of my other up upcoming videos, I'll even tell you how the word iceberg actually came to fruition. Um, I invented that word about two, 20 years, uh, I don't know, maybe 15 years, 20 years ago. I don't know when the movie Titanic came out. But, um, but I'll show you some more videos like this about big iceberg orders. And because the key is, fellow traders, if you want to be competitive and you want to have a game plan and you want to know how to make money in today's markets, you have to be able to follow the big boys. Once you think you're smarter than them, I got bad news. You're going to lose all your money. That's, I've been doing this for a long time. I've worked for some of the best trading firms in the world, uh, living here in New York. And the first mistake that I was taught is I wasn't taught. <laughs> and until I finally learned from somebody and showed me that this is how the game's being played. And it's been like this since the market ever started, 
you know, especially now you got the best tech, technology to do it, utilize it. Because if you don't, you're just making your life harder. So in other words, follow the money. So if you like this video, just click here on the bottom, like us, like this video, and most importantly, click the subscribe button and you'll be getting more alerts of videos just like this. Thanks for watching and happy trading.